This is one of the programs that the National Gallery of Art intends to revive. It's an opportunity for distinguished personalities to talk to the art community about issues affecting the sector. To walk the talk, there was an exhibition on the sidelines. These personalities are gathered in this venue in Abuja to look at the current issues in the development of contemporary Nigerian art in order to enlighten people about the various aspects of visual art. After years in limbo, this is the 12th annual distinguished lecture organized by the National Gallery of Art. The National Gallery of Art annual distinguished lecture came into being in 1995. It was actually designed to be an annual event. Since then, we've had 11 editions. The last was in Calabar, Cross River State, in 2012, with Professor Dele Jegede as a distinguished lecturer. Ever since, it has been in limbo due to circumstances beyond our control for about eight years. I am glad to announce today that this program is back to stay as an annual event, and so will the others that have suffered the same fate. <laughs> Personality addressing the audience is Jerry Bwari, a professor of fine art at the Ahmad Bella University, Zaria. He points out some factors affecting art development, from education, art collection, forgery, and consequences of not having a national edifice. The point I'm making is to remind us that we have an enviable yet to be fully harnessed cultural and artistic heritage as rich and almost as old as China's that can always provide new, authentic, indigenous perspectives, new ways of seeing beyond looking, and new ways of advancing our capacity not only to think outside the box, but with due apologies to Professor Soludo, the ability to even think without the box. How can we convince our political rulers? And I insist on using rulers, not leaders, for good reason, to see that the answer to some of the married challenges lies in Shokoto, not in Sokoto. One of the major challenges that the creative artists are facing in Nigeria is what the National Gallery is addressing. That is the promotion. Promotion and exposition. Art appreciation is really low in this part of the world. And because of uh, this, it also affects funding. The idea is to ensure that creativity goes beyond art for art's sake that visual art becomes a veritable and dependable tool for wealth creation, self-reliance and employment generation. Yeah. 